I am Dr. Madhu Ahuja. I am a senior gynecologist at Max Hospital, Patpurga. Today we shall be discussing the topic of polycystic ovarian disease. Now polycystic ovarian disease is a very common condition and I have a lot of girls, young girls in college, late in school coming to me with this condition. Let me first just inform you that there are two separate conditions. One is what is called as polycystic ovary. These are just incidental findings on ultrasound. And one is the polycystic ovarian disease or polycystic ovarian syndrome. These two are different. So don't panic on seeing a report of polycystic ovaries on ultrasound if ultrasound has been done for any reason. There is a set criteria which doctors follow. Out of three symptoms, one must have at least two symptoms to be labeled as polycystic ovarian disease. Commonly you see irregular periods, polycystic appearance of ovaries on ultrasound and evidence of increased male hormones in your blood or in the form of acne, hirsutism, etc. Along with the hormonal investigation that may be required. The doctor will also assess you for evidence of metabolic syndrome and prolactin level. These are essentials to categorize the severity of the problem in you. Polycystic ovarian disease presents mainly in two ways. One is with irregular periods and there are situations in which you may have polycystic ovarian disease with normal periods. So whenever you are visiting a doctor, it is essential that we be led by the symptoms that you are having. If somebody is having irregular periods along with increased hair growth, acne then please visit a gynecologist if you are just having regular periods with acne increased hair growth visit a dermatologist do not go to slimming clinics hair removal clinics before visiting a doctor the other thing is that in all cases it is not required that you have expensive investigation very simple investigations very few tests can diagnose the condition it is up to the doctor to order these tests free and make it a cost-effective affair thank you